Hi guys, welcome to TechBased. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to enable the new UI for the Windows Desktop Spotlight in Windows 11. For this video, we're gonna have to be on the latest uh, dev channel build, which is 25,197. And in this video, I'm gonna show you the quick steps of enabling this new UI for the Windows Spotlight. Of course, I'm gonna show it to you after we enable it. Before showing you anything, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated because it helps me out a lot. So of course, first of all, we're going to have to install Vive tool yet again, as always, just go ahead and click on the download link in the article below in the description, download the latest version. And of course, after you download it, you can just right click on it and then extract all you don't need other software. And here you're going to have to click on browse and extract this into the system 32 location. That would be this PC, local disk C, Windows, scroll down to system 32, click on select folder, extract, continue, and then you should be good to go. The files were successfully extracted and then you can delete this archive if you no longer need it. Now we're gonna have to open up CMD so just search CMD on the search box and then click on run as administrator and user account control click on yes. In CMD you're gonna have to paste in three different commands the first one would be this one just paste it and then press enter you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration this is the next command and this is the last command as easy as that. After you enable all this and you receive this successfully set feature configuration message after you ran each command, you can close out CMD. And of course, it is recommended to do a system restart for the changes to take effect. After the restart, we're going to have to right click on our desktop and then click on personalize in order to activate desktop spotlight. Go into the background section and then from here, from this drop down, select Windows Spotlight. Then you can close this out. And as I've said, Windows Spotlight will randomly select your pictures or backgrounds for your computer. But now if you right click on that button, and up top, you're going to have this new UI that will bring you more info about certain images. As you can see, this is now just a test thing. This is not something that was officially announced by Microsoft, but the UI looks actually really nice. It has a really nice design. And as you can see, we have some lower map, some text here. As I've said, this is not official, but it is a hidden feature in Windows 11. Maybe in the next or in the future builds, we're going to see this as an official feature. And of course, we have here wallpaper selections, some information description of course thumbs up thumbs down learn more which will open up the microsoft edge and if you want you can e simply minimize it by clicking on this button and you have here just the more info the thumbs up the thumbs down the name of this wallpaper of course and you can switch on to the next one as easy as that and then you can close the new ui in my opinion this actually looks nice and it could be a really nice addition to windows 11 regarding the personalization part of it so this is how you can enable the new desktop spotlight ui in windows 11. Of course, this is not really useful right now because it will only show you the default Windows 11 wallpapers and some default descriptions. But if you want to test it out and see for yourself how this looks, it actually is quite interesting. Don't forget that the download link for Vive tool and all the commands used in this video will be in the article below in the description. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.